Time we have to save our son if we want him to carry on our super hilarious and kind of creepy clown heritage. Hey, this is my bullet. Ah! <laughs> well, HP, once again, our 37 year anti fun plan to take over Fairy World has been thwarted. Yes, Sanderson, it seems that as long as there are fairies on Earth, we will never get the upper hand. I can't believe they're making us drive home this time. Goodbye, Flappy! We love you! Should have finished law school. <laughs> Didn't see that turn there. Me neither. Oh, oh, baby! baby! I thought you said there was no other way. I'm a clown. <laughs> Want to stop for a corn dog, some nachos, maybe a slushy? No. What I want is to find an unwitting human pawn, perhaps a baby. We could take 37 years to mold it into our ultimate weapon. But what are the odds of that? Phew! Good thing I was wearing my helmet. Ah! I'm okay! <laughs> Sanderson, I think this is the beginning of a beautiful new 37-year plan. <laughs> come on, come on! Be three o'clock already! Be the first day of summer already! Timmy, you can't manipulate the fabric of time by staring at the clock. Time bends for no man. Yeah, but we're boys. It's worth a try. Be the first day of summer already! I did it! I am the Lord of Time! of year when we get to constantly use our magic and hang with Timmy without the annoying interruption of the educational system. Come on already! Yes, come on already. It's been 37 years. Now it's time to put our plan into action. And this is the year, finally. All the magic will be ours in five... Four! Three! Two! One! One. Kids up any time I choose. The beach, the mall. Family visits to the Taj Mahal. You can do the things that your parents forbid. Like scream, summer's not a bummer. Cause we're kids just being kids. It's time. It's here. Our very, very favorite time of year. No school. Just play! Granny wishes the entire day! Watch 
sure that this is allowed. We should help them be destructive and loud. Because our kids just being kids. Running wild and running free. Kids just being kids. What can I teach me? Kids just being kids. Close your eyes and count to three. There's nowhere safe for you and me with those kids just being kids. These rockets with my credit card! My toys! My work! It's not my problem till September 3rd! My town! Bad! Wait, something horrible is going down! They can do the things that their parents were here! Like Steve! They'll kill themselves in summer because the kids just be in kids! Kids just be in kids! Wrecking things and ruining stuff! Kids just be in kids! Are you sure that this is enough? No! It's just being kids. Taking risks, we must act up. And save our kids from all the stuff. Taking risks, we must act up. And save our kids from all the stuff. And those kids just being kids. It's not supposed to be my problem until September 3rd! Look at those kids. They're destroying my town. What do you think I should do? <laughs> a town meeting. That's a great idea. That's your worst idea ever. Get off, you little, I mean, equally sized brat. I'm Chet, you betcha, and I demand to talk to, I mean, blame the mayor for everything that's happened. Wait. He's the mayor. I'm the goat, see? I'm eating a tin can. Bah. <laughs> How can you just sit there buying when our children are injuring themselves and, more importantly, our stuff? I don't speak goat. But I don't like the tone or smell of our new goat mayor. Isn't he technically naked? <laughs> what are you coming after me for? He's the mayor! Chompy, what are we gonna do? Stop! Flappy Bob? That's right, folks. It's me, Flappy Bob. Owner, proprietor, and chief operating officer of Flappy Bob's Learnatorium. <laughs> sorry, terribly sorry. Flappy Bob? I always thought you were a clown. I'm no clown. I'm the guy with the answer to all your summertime problems. Allow me to present Camp Learnatorium, a brand new 24 hours a day, all summer long, daycare center and educational camp. Uh, we can't put them in the Learnatorium all summer, can we? Of course you can, with a major credit card. Gary, Batty. <laughs> You're sitting here complaining about all that you've been through. With a whole summer remaining, you must be asking who can protect your little darlings from the bad things you are born. Let me tell you, Flappy Bob's the clown you're looking for. Before they skin their knees, before they're black and blue, before they've cut TB, or keep annoying you, before they break their necks, before they break their arms, before they're all but wrecks, before they do more harm. Shots. No more naked runs. No, if we don't act now, we'll be trapped in Camp Lernatorium. Before he steals our summer, before it's chicken mate, we've got to stop that puppy bomb before it's way too late. Why sit here just complaining? Why even take the chance? Leave your kitties with a chap who wears a polka dot in pants. I know that it seems hard, it is. but a little bit unfair. You're right. But someone's got to be there when you know you can't be there. You don't want to be. Might be a tad expensive, but let me ask of you. Won't it cost more down the line if the cops are blaming you for the injuries incurred while your children wreck the town? You can learn to love your cellmate or just learn to love this clown. Get ready. You heard.
heard it here first, folks. This is Chet Umecha saying that starting tomorrow, every kid in Dimsdale is to report to Flappy Bob's Camp Learnatorium for the rest of the summer! <laughs> I mean, for their own good. No! <laughs> yes! <laughs> Mm, sorry, sorry. For a second there, I thought the kids might not enjoy spending the summer at Camp Learnatorium. And then I thought, who cares? Right! I'll bet the kids will have a great time! And if they don't, who cares? Yippee! <laughs> Yay! Have a nice summer. to pee in this. Everything looks safe and sound. I'll get the padded encyclopedias. <laughs> Neat! I'll get the broccoli. And the funnel. I can't take spending the whole summer here. I've only been here five minutes and I'm ready to pull my hair out. Well, don't give it to me. I'll just cough it back up. <clears throat> <laughs> What do you cone domes want? It's already boring enough around here. Oh, hi, Turner. Don't mind us. We're just enjoying the show. Your misery is like going to the movies for us. Want some popcorn? It's unsalted and unbuttered, right? And unpopped. You know, Turner, all of your misery has one common denominator. Adults. Wait a minute. What do you mean, adults? Who shuts them all down early? Who wants you in by dark? Yeah! Who gets all mad and surly when we make a smart remark? Who do we have to hide from? From Dimsdale to old Beijing? They're taking away our summer! Adults ruin everything! Adults ruin everything! With all their rules and laws! Adults ruin everything! We must fight back! with my heat beam. Too bad it's not your call. But I've got two magic fairies. One tweeting to be twirled. Adults can't ruin everything if us kids ran the world. Adults ruin everything. But kids would run things right. Adults ruin everything. But we know we can fight. Adults ruin everything. That's how this day unfurled. But that won't happen if I wish that kids could rule the world.
Gods are ruling the Earth! Hold me! But I don't like you like that! <laughs> but I need to be held! No, she doesn't like you like that! Phase two is complete, HP. It's almost as though we're finally unstoppable, Sanderson. How is that possible? Must I break it down for you? Yes, break it down. It would be criminal if you didn't. Mission mind bitch to be the worst administrator. I'm sad to son, I'm anti-fun. Yeah. And all those fairies can bite my bun. Yeah. With my boss HP, who gonna be the big time rulers? You got that G. We're, We're pixies, yeah. we're pixies. And since the 1960s, we raised that clown to be our tool. To be the fairies, so, so we can rule. We're, we're pixies, pixies, we're pixies. It's going just as we predict seas. We can't stop now, the time is near. We're very well, and this world here are ruled by us. By us, you hear? By us, you hear? By by You betcha with the news. This fall is all about chocolate, and homework is officially declared super yucky. Which means I guess it's time for me to go to work. Where do I work? The White House. Wait a minute. I'm the president of Kid World? Well, everywhere but Florida, they're still voting. Don't get too cocky, Timmy. Being the president is a big job. Big job, schmig job. I'm the president. It's not like I have to answer to anybody. Mr. President, Mr. President, Mr. President, Mr. President. Oh, oh, Mr. President, who do you like better, huh? Or her? Hey, hey, I can't see! What do I do? What do I do? Whatever you want. You're in charge. I'm in charge. Kids had no power. I had to correct. We kids are the boss now, and you can expect that things will be different with me at the wheel. I'm ten and in charge now, and here's what I feel. I made a place that the kids are not running. The view from our treehouse is really quite stunning. Our plan, look, it's working. We're really quite cunning. To Jorgen Von Spangle we go. Nice hat. It's candy for breakfast and ice cream for lunch. It's candy for dinner. Uh-oh! Let us go! Timmy needs us! No, he 
It does not, nor does any other child. According to the rules, fairies can only be assigned to children in need. But there are extenuating circumstances. I know this is probably a bad time, but what does extenuating mean? Oh, I'm sorry. Here is what it means. I'd rather learn by phonics. I know you're upset and also on fire, but let me explain something to you. With my muscles, I will tussles with all those who dare discusses. A clear and present pretzels to my authority. To my knuckles, you will buckles. Like a chicken, you will flaxels. For I so do love the rules, and I know the rules love me. You will learn to fear my mighty face. If my song won't help you get the gist And all you fools might disagree But you will all answer to me With this polka, I won't joke But first this frappe mocha mm, I was shocked when I awoke To a world where kids all ruled With my biceps, I must triceps To see the kids are now the niceps The magic with the plyceps For your jobs must be retooled Oh, I love to get the draw the line And your morons make me all the time For the rules are very clear Oh, now the time is here For me to pull back the fairies Bring them all home one by one Pull back the fairies Now that my mocha is done Pull back the fairies Now that the kids have the reins Now we're pulling, pulling, pulling back the fairies So I can bring them pain Oh no! We're in a fairy dungeon! Well, nothing left to do now except some pull-ups! <laughs> now what do you want to do? Okay, Cosmo and Wanda might be gone, but everything's great! After all, I'm the president! And I get all these free pins! You! That's right, President Turner. Ah, oh, Circus Peanuts! That's right, it's me! Did you really think you'd be able to get away with sending your kid armies to destroy Camp Lernatorium? Yeah, that's why we tore it down! And here's a commemorative pen from a bill I signed endorsing the action! Hey, thanks! I oh, darn it! That place was great! Dude, that place was lame! <laughs> it can't be lame! Everything I knew about fun went into that place! <laughs> oh, confetti! Sorry about that! No, that was fun! You should do more stuff like that! I was taught that boring was fun, that dull was fun. Who would tell you that dull and boring was fun? Hello, son. <gasps> what the heck is going on here? Montage, please. Since the days we found him in the untamed wilds of Kansas, we have been secretly watching over Flappy Bob. Whether it was as a baby. Or as a young man. We always delivered our special brand of caregiving to see that Flappy was taken care of. Even if he didn't know how. We made sure he had everything he needed to live our, I mean, his dream. Learnatorium. 
37 year long dream you destroyed, Turner. Yeah, he did destroy my dream. So who are you anyway? Long lost cousins? Distant uncles, what? And what's with the floating? We have that kind of money. Walking is for poor people. We like to think of ourselves as your godparents. Godparents? Oh no, that means they can grant a wish. Godparents with the money to give you anything you want if you just sign here. As part of the contract, you get to make the world exactly the way you want to. And all we want in return are certain merchandising rights, a few royalties, and absolute control of fairy world. Oh my gosh, I know what they're up to. No, you have to listen to me. I know they're the guys who've given you everything you've ever wanted, and I'm just the guy who destroyed your life on dream, but you have to listen to me. Boy, that came out wrong. But I gave you the pen! Forget it, kid. I know who my friends are, and I'm signing that contract! Wait! Hey, Fluffy Bob, can't you see what they've done? They made it a pawn, and clearly you were the one. They took away your clowny clothes, your floppy shoes and big red nose. Just look around. How could you say this? Since you were born, they decided your fate. From the style of your car, down to the food that you ate. I know it seems they gave a lot, but I'm telling you it's part of a plot. A plot that you can stop. Stop it before it's too late. Hey, Fluffy Pop, you hear what he's been spreading? The lies that he's been telling? I know where this is heading. Towards turning you against us. To resent us. And resent us. Who are the villains? Yeah, don't you be forgetting. It was you, Flappy Bob. Yeah, you were the one. We protected and respected. As though you were our son. And now you're in the middle. You can fiddle with this riddle. Or you can sign this deal and trust so that your wishes will be done. Where's the fun? Who should I turn to? Where's the fun? How can I learn who? Who is the one? The one I can trust to tell me what's fun. Where is the fun? Why should I trust you? He was the one. You are the one who wanted to shun everything I always thought fun. Hey, Fluffy Bob, can't you see in your heart? There's a role you play, and dude, this just ain't the right part. I know my actions weren't ideal, but how your clowny parents feel about the path you chose. giant mistake uh, 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 uh. but changing my life's a risk i'm not ready to take this nose pants hair and shoes they're all my past and now i choose to wish for a world a world that fits all my views a world where i am safe it's over turner you lose thanks for the pen <laughs> Happy Peppy Dad! I'm Happy Peppy Mom! No! Don't make this any more painful than it has to be! Isn't there supposed to be a good cop and a bad cop? We had some cutbacks. Now, do you want to stay in fairy jail for the rest of your fairy life? Or do you want to blame Cosmo? No! Please! Okay, good cop over. Blame Cosmo! Blame Cosmo? I was lost till he found me. And although he confounds me by his crown, is where I know I should be. Yes, I know he's a moron with a brain made. 
made of boron, and yet I'm drawn to him magically. And through every moment of turmoil and moment of pain, through all of our misadventures, one thing remains. Facing pixies, bullies, and jarheads, I'll never be blue. Kinda naggy. Did you get the handcuff key? Yep, Operation Distract Dragon with a stupid gooey love song works every time. <laughs> I saw her and no other. <laughs> oh, and that part with the fingerprints. Fingers aren't shaped like that. That is love. <laughs> Come on, we've got to get down to Earth. Well, HP, now that Flappy has given us total control over Fairy World, what do you want to do with it? I'm thinking dull and gray. I was thinking gray and dull, but that's why you're the boss. Did you hear the one about? Ah, pixie magic! It's sucking away all the fun! Pretty color left for one of us to slide down the rainbow bridge. Wow, there wasn't a manly word in that sentence. We need a magic wand. Oh no, pixie magic. <gasps> I still have my wand. Maybe I can stop this. <laughs> ah, no! ah! <laughs> This 
to be a fun place. But now we wear a sad face, since pixies have all replaced the way that things are done. There's no more granting wishes. You can't turn into fishes. Now pipe down to the dishes. Come on now, everyone. Please are the unfundamentals for us fairy god parentals who are now devoid of wishing and of birth. We're certifiably mental because these unfundamentals make me very bad as fun as giving birth. I'll bet it's even worse down there on Earth. Timmy? Timmy? Trampolines are bouncy free, and there's a pad on every knee. Everything's fine, far as I see, but I can't help but think out loud the things a kid had said somehow. My mom and dad would not be proud of the path I've taken in life. Have I been wrong? Have I been used? Should I embrace my nose and shoes? Except these gifts I once refused. Be protected. Our bodies disinfected. This is just as I suspected. What would happen if this world was ruled by fun? Fundamental surely. All you parentals must see how the avoid of fun is really is. But all these unfundamentals seem quite instrumental to keep all of you rowdy kids in line. If you need us, we'll be playing the back nine. <laughs> Well, Sanderson, we've done it. One of our 37-year plans has finally given us control over all the magic. Yes, HP, if this place were any less fun, it would need a librarian. <laughs> well, floppy shoes, big red nose, I guess this is goodbye. <laughs> Hey, my floating rich friends! And just think, all we had to do to beat our fairy enemies was rip a clown child away from his super hilarious destiny and convince him that fun wasn't fun and that boring was fun. You'd have to be a clown to fall for that. A really dumb clown. Ha ha! Ha ha ha! That kid was right! They were using me! I'll show them who's a dumb clown. Ugh, I'm gonna have to do this by myself. Timmy! It's horrible! Pixies have taken control of Fairy World! What the? Wow, for a quarter of a stick in there, I thought I was in big trouble! <laughs> I don't know who said that. But with the right amount of fun, anything's possible. Flappy Bob? That's right. Flappy Bob. <laughs> Clown! I was a clown at birth, but those two rich guys raised me to be a boring businessman. And if there's one thing boring businessmen know, it's how to find a loophole. Oh, oh, that's good. You get those cone domes down here, and I'll do the rest. And there's only one way to do that. Let's get fun. I like fun. I'm all about the fun now. Now, but it can all be undone. So grab your kites and water guns. My bike! My pool! This big sticky bun! It's not a crime to have your time in the sun! Kids just being kids! Acting up and eating dirt! Kids just being kids! They could all get hurt! We're pixies, we're pixies, we firmly 
Pixie. The time has come, the deal's going through. There's fun stay there, yeah. we'll come to you. We're Pixies, we're Pixies. This is how we get our Kixies. Our plan has worked and they have lost. Let's ping on down and show who's the boss. The Pixies, the Pixies, the Pixies. <laughs> Shout real loudly. It's your turn now to roar. You get to parade proudly with a straw man bugle cord. You find the kids and rile them. I'll give them what they need. Oh, Damn with it. this much fun, those coneheads should be here at breakneck speed. A cop's ruined everything. At least that's what I thought. You kids ruined everything. That's the lie I bought. But someone, someone else was pulling strings, far as, as we could, could tell. tell. But you and me can set us free. Everything ends well. That's quite enough, Flappy. You lied to me. You lied to me for 37 years. You tricked me and kept me from being the super hilarious, if not somewhat creepy, clown I was destined to be. Yes, yes we did, duh. But we have an ironclad contract. Oh, I agree. Every word in this contract is totally binding, which is why I'd like to turn your attention to this. In return for making the world what you want, yada, 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 we get the power, yada, 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 Earth will be safe and fun, as defined by Flappy Bob. And guess what I define as fun now? Everything being exactly the way it's supposed to be. Oh, smoof. You know, you probably shouldn't have sent him to law school. You might have thwarted us this time, Turner, but mark my words, our next 37-year plan will not fail. When you're 47, you'll pay. Extenuatingly manly! Way to go, Flappy! You did it! You brought fun back to Doomsdale! Yeah, I just wish my clown mother and clown father were here to see this. I'm sure wherever they are, they're proud. We're, we're so, so proud! proud. Huh? huh? <laughs> Flappy! We're We've been looking everywhere for you! you. <laughs> Except, well, this spot right here! We looked everywhere that could be clowns. Fast food restaurants, the circus, that hotel in Las Vegas. We spent a lot of time in Vegas. 36 years! They comped our room! We even checked the U.S. Congress! It was full of clowns, but none of them were fun! Mom! Dad! Dad! And we'll never lose you again! But if we do, let's all agree to meet in Vegas! You found his parents for him? Hey, he said he wanted everything the way it should be! Well, pixies aren't the only ones who can exploit a loophole, you know! Cosmo! Here's your wand back! Oh, you saved the day and the fun! Which is weird because normally you're the one killing it! Stop it, Cosmo! See? And best of all, with the Pixies defeated and Flappy Bob on the path to fun, that means no more Camp Lernatorium. Right? Hey there, special guests. Welcome to Gary and Betty's Lernatorium. You're going to have the most fungicational, edgecarific summer of your lives! Uh, guys, fun time? Fun time! Uh, this is fun. I'll handle it.
Maybe we should try a six-week plan next time. Yeah.